This is what my friend told me today at school. Yes? Apparently, he has a girlfriend now. Good for him. Yes, and he said they already kissed. They seem to be taking it fast. He also said that her lips were very soft. I bet it tasted like lemons. I'm so envious. I want a girlfriend too. I want to go on dates and kiss her. Here is your tea, sir. Thank you. My name is Yorimitsu Raiko. I'm in my second year at high school and I'm the heir of the Honorable Raiko family. And this cool lady right here is Ayami Kiryu. Her family has been serving us for generations and now she works as my personal maid. She's great at her job and she's been taking great care of me since I was younger. She's hardworking, flawless with her work and is basically a perfect maid. Ms. Ayame, what should I do? I think you should try it out yourself. But I don't have a girlfriend to go on a date with or to kiss. Would you be willing to take the role, Ms. Ayame? Yes. Just kidding. Huh? I don't mind. Huh? Are you sure about this, Miss Ayame? End of topic. No, 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 I should calm down. Uh, let's get my head straight. Maybe it's just a wise joke from the maid. Yes, that, that must be it. Miss Ayame, that wasn't a good joke. You know, I'm an ordinary teen. I can't help but to imagine things when you make those jokes. I wasn't joking. Huh? If you don't believe me, should we do it now? What exactly are we going to do? A kiss, sir. It was giving me chills down my spine. I remember that the dish served today for lunch used some lemons. Uh, does that mean our kiss would taste like lemons now? I've been moisturizing my lips too. Does that mean you have soft lips? What do you say? Um, I demand that you stop teasing me. That was close. I almost lost against her charm and gave in to temptation. Um, I didn't mean to tease you. That makes it even worse. You're only supposed to kiss your date. I thought you were the one who asked if I can do it for you. You have a point. I would do anything for you. Now why are you so dedicated? It's my job. Because it's your job? Would everyone be this willing if it was part of their job? I've known her for very long now, but she rarely shows her emotions, so I don't exactly get what she's thinking. Are you sure you're willing to do anything for me? Yes, of course. For example, can we go on a date and hold hands? Oh, your ideas sound like they're coming from an elementary schooler. What can I do? For instance, something a male and a female would do when they're together. A matchmaking party? Why do you think so? Am I wrong? Yes, I wasn't expecting that. Okay. Hmm. Miss Ayame has a disgusted expression on her face. I wonder why. <laughs> hmm. I, Ayame Kiryu, have a master who I work for. He is the boy right there who's chasing a butterfly right now. His name is Yorimatsu Raiko. He is the heir of the Raiko family. I have been educated since I was little to become his personal maid. I have perfected all the basic housework skills, manners, and all the other things from various fields. I was called to visit the head of the family the other day. The reason I invited you over today is simple. Yes, sir. Yorimitsu is in his teens now. It's about time he gets interested in the opposite sex. I understand. But he is the heir of the Raiko family. He cannot be chasing after the charming booties of women. I understand, sir. 
Getting involved in a honey trap scandal is an absolute nightmare. Yes, sir. <laughs> the head of the Raiko family has been scared of women since he got involved in a scandal a month ago where he fell for a honey trap arranged by his rival powers. His wife was furious, and after the scandal, he would hide behind his desk, shaking violently whenever he had to face women. He was shaking verbally as well. I get it, sir. What would you like me to do? I want you to teach him the horror of falling for a honey trap. Therefore, I would like you to honey trap Yorimitsu. You want me to do it? Yes, that's right. If Yorimitsu fails to resist your charms and falls for your honey trap, I will punish him. Don't go easy on him. This is all necessary for him to become the next head of the family in the future. Yes, sir. Good. I'm counting on you. He is very dignified, but it's just his voice. Like that, I had to honey trap my master and tempt him to fall for my trap. <laughs> Something is wrong. I told him he can do whatever he wants with me, but he hasn't done anything to me yet. No, I should be happy that he hasn't fallen for my trap, but I was having mixed feelings about this. Am I not attractive enough? I'm confident that I've been doing my best to look nice so that he wouldn't be embarrassed to have me as his maid. To be completely honest, I think I look pretty attractive. <laughs> and this, am I losing to a butterfly? Oh, God. I can't help but feel upset. Of course, I wouldn't show it on my face, though. <laughs> this makes me frustrated. I think I'll have to be more forceful in the, in the process. Master? <laughs> Let's go on a date. <laughs> huh? Yes, a date. He initially wanted to go on a date. If I can tempt him during the date, he might get excited, go a bit overboard, and fall for my trap. A, a date? What should I do? It's my very first date with a girl. It's making me nervous. Am I allowed to go on a date with her in the first place? Ms. Ayame said this was part of her job, but wouldn't it be considered as power harassment? Would I be okay? I'm sorry to keep you waiting. <gasps> Are you alright? Ms. Ayame, I only see you wearing a maid outfit. You look so different when you wear casual clothes. Oh, do you think so? I was too stunned to speak by your beauty. Ms. Ayame, did she dress up just for our date? I have to try my best today. I will escort Ms. Ayame during our date today. We don't have much time, so should we get going now? Oh, uh, okay, sure. Don't worry, I have everything planned out for today's date. You can leave everything to me. Whoa, you're so dependable. Looks like I'm the one who'll be escorted today. Just like that, Ms. Ayame escorted me through the day. It made me feel... a bit pathetic. Sir, can I take your hand? Huh? A hand holding date. I thought you wanted it. Y uh, yes please. May I? Yes. Oh. Hmm? What's the matter? No, nothing. It's nothing. I shouldn't think about it too much. I'm gonna have so much fun. <laughs> oh, my hands are sweating like crazy. It's my first time holding hands with the man. 
I didn't expect this to be so nerve-wracking. I never thought I would feel his body temperature so much from his hands. No, no, no. I shouldn't be sensitive or my body temperature would rise even more. Uh, he must feel bothered if he has to hold on to sweaty hands. Ugh, first of all, I shouldn't forget what the objective is. I'm here to make him fall from my trap after putting him off of his guard during the date. This is a honey trap that would benefit him in the future. It's nothing more or less than that. It's not like I wanted to go on a date and hold hands. That's definitely not my intention. Um... Huh? What's wrong? I have to use the restroom. Okay, I'll wait for you here. Oh, my makeup is ruined because I sweat so much. Oh, hey, you're handsome. Oh, are you alone? Oh, how about you join us and we go somewhere fun to play? What do you mean, play? After I fixed my makeup and returned from the bathroom, my master was being asked on a date from a group of girls. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> we'll be doing bad things. Bad things? What are they? <laughs> uh huh. What do you think? Oh no, he's interested. Oh, he never gets tempted by me, but he's so interested in going out with these girls, he doesn't even know. Oh, am I that unattractive for you? Oh, I'm sorry. I'm actually waiting for someone. Yes! Refuse, Master! Reject them! Come on, don't worry. She'll probably forgive you if you apologize to her later. <laughs> Are you sure about that? Oh, I'm never going to forgive him. But I'm sorry. I, I can't just leave her. The girls continued to pressure him to go out with them. But he was gentle, yet firm, when refusing. So they soon gave up and left him alone. Master. Uh, Ms. Ayame, you're finally back. Why didn't you go with them? Why didn't you go with them? Huh? Oh, I guess you saw it then. They could have made all of your dreams come true. What? <sighs> I'm... Just a temporary substitute. If you can find a date, I think that would be better for both of us. Mm, but I don't think I'll ever go out with them. Why do you think so? Because they're honey trapping me, aren't they? What? They came straight towards me as soon as they arrived, which means that I was their target since the very beginning. If they were just looking for someone to go out with, that wouldn't make sense. There were other men around us who were here alone. You... you realized? Is that why you refused? Well, yeah. They didn't ask any other men after they got to know that I had no interest in going out with them. So I'm pretty sure that they came here just for me. And I wonder who made them come after me. He looks overly optimistic and bit dumb, but it shocks me to see how he's actually very responsible. And I'm on a date with you right now, Ms. Ayame. <laughs> but you seem like you were about to fall in love with them. Huh? What? Am I? Are you angry? Why would I feel angry? <sighs> Maybe you're feeling jealous about me acting interested in going out with those girls? Hmm? <laughs> Just kidding. I know that's impossible. No way. Was I feeling jealous of those girls? Um, uh, Ms. Ayame, are you okay? Do I have feelings for him? Since I went on a date with Ms. Ayame... Ms. Ayame? Ms. Ayame? Y yes, sir. Why are you standing so far away? I think it's completely normal, sir. Uh, are you sure? I have no idea why, but she seems to be keeping a distance from me. 
no, 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 a maid can't fall in love with her master. This is unacceptable. I should keep a safe distance from him until I come back to my senses. But to make him fall from my honey trap, I'll have to get near him. Oh, no! Hmm? Ms. Ayame, who's usually very chill, looks very confused. Is something bothering her? Ms. Ayame, if you have anything that's bothering you, you can talk to me about it any time. I'm willing to do whatever I can to help you. Then don't come near me. Huh? Did I do something to her? Yorimitsu, how's it going? You better not be chasing after a lady's booty. A lady's booty? Yep. Or do you prefer their breasts? What? I... Sir, I think this is a bit too early for Mr. Yorimitsu. What? You're still chasing butterflies? Yes, it's a lot of fun. You're making me worried, actually. But Mizayame is apparently... Oh boy, it's going to be a challenge for her. Huh? 